On to the next board. On to the next board. Yes. Yes. I'll just be in the middle of the night, actually. <laughs> <laughs> We took some time to tie up some of the loose ends that we have around the deck build. Things like finishing up the ledger board and completing the steps from the lower level of the deck up to the upper main level. With those completed, it means that today is actually a pretty big day for us because we are going to be installing all of the decking boards on the main level of the deck and finishing the deck. The end is near, it's almost done. The end is near. <laughs> So I decided to go ahead and plane this portion right here. We had three boards sandwiched together. Some of the boards were a little bit bigger than the other ones, some a little bit smaller, so we went ahead and made everything flat. I know they do shrink. We'll look at the deck boards here in a second. But uh, these also, have been sitting for a few weeks now, they all did shrink, they shrank together, but the get, I guess the height differences never changed. So we took the planer, planed everything flat, so the, I guess the picture frame we're gonna do, is actually gonna lay on top there, or sit on top there flat, and not like this or that in certain locations. So it's all nice and flat now. But let's check out the deck boards real quick. So you can see there's a gap here now. If you guys remember, we used that camo tool. It gave like a, I think like a sixteenth of an inch gap. We slammed everything as tight as we could, knowing that it's all wet, it's all pressure treated lumber, so it's gonna shrink when the sun hits on it and starts drying out. So now we have about three eighths of an inch gap. We did the deck stairs the same way, and those are actually shrinking over the past couple of days. So now the top deck, we're gonna do the same exact way. We're gonna slam everything tight. When it's all said and done, we'll have about a three eighths gap in between them. The good news is we're using the camo tools. So we can hide all your screw holes. You know, like they only go, they go that way, you ain't gonna see it. Got it. I see how today's going, Josh. <laughs> Guy match up, set him in stone, go ahead screw this guy down, um, work this 45 into him, get him set, and then uh, we'll start working our way down, screwing it in. Because this, the, you know, this board, they're, they're kind of like this, or they're kind of like this, or you gotta maneuver it a little bit. They're not straight, so let's get this guy in set in stone, put him in place, get him screwed in, and then we'll get started working that side down back and forth and put more screws in. Okay. We're taking a quick break from the deck build because our box from Bright Sellers just arrived and I can't wait to see what kind of wines are inside. Yes. In case you guys don't already know, Bright Sellers is a monthly wine club that matches you with wine you'll love and then delivers it directly to your door. Makes my life a lot easier. Trying to find that right bottle of wine is always a guessing game for me and it never really turns out. <laughs> but with Bright Sellers' seven question quiz, we just answer a couple of questions about things like what type of chocolate we like and how adventurous we are and then they select the perfect bottles of wine for us Plus, we get to taste different types of wine from all around the world. And date nights are win every time. <laughs> I'm trying to decide whether we should go with the Sprig Rose or the World Line tonight. This one's going to be more like cookout, and this is like night in with friends. Which actually, 
since it's date night, we should probably go with this one because this is more anniversary. The wine education cards that come with each bottle give you information on things like the proper serving temperature, what type of food you can pair the wines with, all kinds of great stuff for people like Josh who are not really wine connoisseurs. I'm almost there. But wanna be. <laughs> Bright Cellars is giving our subscribers 60% off their first four bottle box. Just visit the link in the description below, take the quiz and get started today. Let's get back to the build. I need you to pull back, and I need a slight that way. Don't push me that way. Move it. Move it. Move it. Now we are. Yeah, we're taking. We are. They're all 20 foot boards. Yep. So we're just taking them up to the deck two at a time, mm -hmm. cutting them, installing we're, them. They were cut off like an inch and a half per one. We didn't want to have. Uh, we actually couldn't find six, uh, anything larger than 16 feet at Lowe's. Right. So we actually special ordered these from 84 Lumber. Mm -hmm. So because I think it's roughly 20 feet, obviously. Mm -hmm. We cut inch and a half off, so there's no seams anywhere, which is. It's nice. Yeah, that's our thing. No seams that's with it. everything. <laughs> oh, we did the same thing in there. We did. So. I mean, it looks better. It's more aesthetically pleasing to the eye. Yeah, it's it sad. Because everybody's out on the deck. He wants to come out so bad. <laughs> I'll get him. You, you get him? You gonna carry him out? I'll carry him out. <laughs> It's an easy task, mm -hmm. but it's very time consuming. Yes, it's very time consuming. Finishing all the stairs with all the screws and then putting, I guess, picture framing it wasn't that bad, but just 
hundreds and hundreds of screws. It just takes their, their so many screws and there's so many steps back and forth, <laughs> like to go get the boards and bring the boards up and then measure each of the boards and then cut all the boards and then put all the boards in place. And then, and then do like a million screws on each of the boards. It just takes like forever. Yeah. But it looks really great. It's great, man, all day, all day long. And it feels so good. And it's it's fun seeing Chuck, like he's super excited. He's just been staring out the window all day <laughs> wanting to come on the deck with us. It's super cute. It's not safe. He, had, he was a little scared going down the steps a little bit. Yes. He wasn't sure. He just, he doesn't see well. I mean, he's almost blind, so he can't really be up here unsupervised. We no, don't want anything safe. to happen to him. We got to get the handrails and stuff up first and then yeah. he we can be up we here enjoying it. Splat. No, definitely <laughs> not. Oh, all right, we're almost halfway there. Yes. Let's get to the halfway point. We'll finish that little portion up and uh, keep on cutting. So can we get done before nightfall? I don't know. I'm not sure what time it is. It's probably six o'clock now, six thirty <laughs> probably. Um, we got two and a half hours left probably. Mm hmm I doubt we're gonna get done in two and a half hours. You hold it. Oh man. Yeah, it's better. So now we're exhausted. You look tired. Do I? Yeah. I feel tired. Stuff it's, being bent uh, over on your hands and knees all day, you know? And I get it, girl. <laughs> <laughs> what are they doing? Guys. Is this seriously the turkey in that thing? Yes. Yes. What the? That's the turkey. <laughs> they want to make sure she doesn't get eaten by the fox and they're going to put her to bed. She was too far down in the pasture. <laughs> I really can't. That thing's probably 45 pounds. That turkey, turkey? I know. I think it's heavy as can be. The things that go on around here. I mean, I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> There will be another, there will be another one. Something new to fall into, it'll be a better one. There will be another, there will be another one. So nightfall came a little bit faster than we would have liked. Yeah, I got that. A little bright, huh? <laughs> so the plan is to call it quits so we don't mess up any cuts. Yes. But we are going to get ourselves set up for a good start tomorrow by getting all of the boards actually up here on the deck so they're ready to be cut and get installed. And So we, we have, I think, 21 boards left to install. It's, it seems like a lot. I we've, we've gotten thirty we, something installed today. It took all, plus we finished the stairs. Took all freaking day. I long. know, I know, it definitely did. I, I was kind of disappointed when we looked and we counted and we realized that it was like twenty some boards left to install because I, I thought we were a little bit closer than that. And Apparently not. Twenty boards is going to take a long time. <laughs> <laughs> it takes so much longer than it looks like it should take. Two, I don't know four, why. Six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32. That's 32 screws per 32 screws per board. So do the math. It's a lot of screws. A lot. A lot. So, yeah. <laughs> Our kids are unhappy because they're on construction site cleanup today. However, I think a couple of hours of building the deck in the hot sun will straighten them out. So, yeah, you know, we're going to be on that. That's good. I mean, it's good for kids to go ahead, come outside and help clean stuff up. Yeah, you know of course. I mean? Yeah. And you know what? Look, nobody's going to be complaining around here because I woke up feeling like I got hit by a truck 
that drove over me once, backed up over top of me, and then hit me one more time. I'll just be in the middle of night, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> huh? Okay. But the deck build kicked, kicked their butt uh, yesterday. It was a long, long, long day. Yeah, we, we did a little bit of the math, <laughs> and we did well over a thousand screws Yes. yesterday. So. You guys, are you ready? You ready to get this thing butt done, done? We have 21 boards to install, is that correct? 21? The last one's going to be screws with the going around thing to hold it to face down for the picture framing. But yeah, we're moving, dude. I think we get them all cut real quick, slam them all in, call it a day, be done. Before you know it, I'll be out here making margaritas. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, ten boards left. To install? I think so. I feel raindrops. Do you really? Yeah. All right, let's just burn this, let's burn this stuff up real quick. All right. Board. Last board, last 32 screws. We got to still do a little picture frame on the side, but we're about done with this bad boy. I can't believe it.